Sugar is expected to return to shelves within the next week or two following recent limited brown sugar supplies that puzzled customers. The government warehouse anticipates receiving more shipments soon, addressing the temporary shortage. The ministry was able to receive four containers in January, which is about 2,000 bags, and an additional eight containers were received last week, 4,000 bags. Today we are in the process of clearing another 10 containers, which is 5,000 bags, 5,000 5, bags of brown sugar, as well as five, um, sorry, five containers of brown sugar and five containers of white sugar. An additional three containers, which is 1,500 bags, are expected to arrive this evening. And another six containers, which is 3,000 bags next week. Commerce Minister Emma Hippolyte attributed recent sugar shipment delays to challenges faced by St. Lucia's main supplier in Guyana. Under CARICOM rules, St. Lucia is mandated to import such commodities from within the region. Less than one month from the start date of the contract on November 29, 2023, the Ministry of Commerce was informed by our supply of sugar from Guyana of its inability to meet our usual demands for the commodity due to poor crop quality and recommended assistance from a neighboring island, <coughs> one of its customers, to supply St. Lucia with 3,000 bags of sugar with the assurance that specialists were assessing the situation and should there be any change, six containers would be shipped to us immediately. Mr. Speaker, initially the Ministry of Commerce was informed that the shipment would not be possible due to the unavailability of 20-foot containers. After the containers were secured by the Ministry of Commerce from a local shipping company, the reason shifted to unfavorable weather patterns, which the company claimed to have adversely affected the sugarcane yield and quality. Despite stern communication and securing containers, St. Lucia's main Guyanese supplier cited various challenges and could not fulfill the full sugar shipment request. The government is seeking a CARICOM exemption and exploring alternative import options from outside the region. The Ministry of Commerce, as part of addressing these issues, have met with the manufacturing sector, who consume large amounts of the white sugar as part of the manufacturing process and we have agreed and given them permission to order the sugar directly. Also, we are making a request to CARICOM for suspension of the CET to allow St. Lucia to order sugar from outside the CARICOM region. From January 2024 through next week's expected shipment, the government anticipates receiving 15,500 bags of sugar comprising 13,000 brown and 2,500 white. Joachim Duplessis, HTS News Force.